Hey, Joseph here. Hey, not much going on this weekend, boys and girls, other than I made a mess of my bench. Look at the bench. It's horrible, it is. Freaking right, it is. I get working on something, I just throw, 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 throw until I can't even see it anymore, eh? Why wouldn't I? But, uh, not much going on this weekend, hey? It's family weekend, it is. Mom's working today. Just finished making Melly an egg sandwich there. Give her some brekkie. Gonna clean this up, wait for her to get off work, and then we're gonna go to the Santa Claus parade we are. Freaking right we are. So maybe I'll take a little clippage of that. Why wouldn't I, eh? But, uh, don't forget to subscribe and like too, eh? Why wouldn't you? But, you know, I would do it for you. My buddy there, uh, One Man Shop, eh? Look him up. One Man Shop. He's trying to get the 600 subs. Help him out, would you? Give him some subs. Why wouldn't you? He works on all sorts of old tractors, eh? Freaking right, in a shed, which makes it even more exciting, eh? Why wouldn't you, bud, eh? Freaking right. Good for you, man. Keep on trucking, bud. You're doing great. Why wouldn't you be? I'm gonna clean this crap up, I am. And uh, I've decided to call the old sport track Close Encounters, I did, eh? I'm gonna call her the old Close Encounters because I'm just going stupid with lights, I am. And uh, you're gonna laugh when you see it and stuff like that, but I don't really care because that's the whole point of doing it, right? To make people laugh. Friggin' right it is. Close Encounters, boys. Hey, eh? What do you think of that name? Tell me what you think. Tell me if you think it's stupid or what. But, uh, I'll show it to you, and then you can tell me if you think it's appropriate or not, eh? <coughs> <laughs> oh, wrong hole, boys. But yeah, I'm just, you know, sitting here trying to find my bench, boys. Okay? Trying to find the old bench rooski. Just destroyed the old workbench I did. Oh, brother. This is a nice test light kit, boys, hey? I've had that for years, I have had, and it works awesome, it does. That's about the only thing I have for Mac Tools, hey? Don't have much for Mac Tools, I don't. Why would I? We're gonna put them goddamn thing, boys. We're gonna put that. We're gonna put this. So this can go here. Butt tray can be empty, that's disgusting, hey? At least I'm using an ashtray now, though, hey? My wife has a big contribution to that, not you boys, hey, and girls. That's all the wife do with it is. The wife is the boss, she is. 2S LiPo, working awesome in the car, no problems at all. Hasn't drained it, has a shut off. You know, it's been working great. So that's the battery to use in that. Don't use the nickel metal hydrides, they just suck. Big time. Suck big time. You're gonna lose all these pins, I can see it coming. I got pins everywhere, boys. Pins and, oh boys, what a mess. There's another pin, boys. Where's the battery hold down? Unbelievable. Boys. Boys, why do I do this, boys? Why in the hell do I do this? Every friggin' time. Not like this at work. I don't know why I'm like this at home. I have no idea. Oh, uh oh. Great. Got to give that to mom for the daycare. More money, boys, hey? Never stop throwing the money out the window, boys. See, my old property taxes went up there in Wyoming, they did, eh? They went from 19.9 to uh, 23. Uh, that's a big jump, boys, eh? That's a big jump. I'm gonna have to move now. Can't afford it anymore. Trying to move, eh? <laughs> oh, there's a battery hole down in the car, for Christ's sake. There she be. Why wouldn't it be? I can't find the hole, Jim. Shh, eh? Can't find the old hole, see. My buddy Brian took his wife to Niagara Falls for the weekend he did, eh? For a little romantic little outgo, eh? Friggin' lucky bastard. I don't wanna do that with my old lady. Friggin' right I do. Gotta find somebody to take care of the old kid Ruski to do that though. We are due for a little us time, we are. We need some us time. That'd be decent. What do all you guys do with your other half, eh? When you're, uh, when you want some me time? What, what happens out there? What's really going on, eh? Tell the old Bellster. Give me some ideas. Besides going out for dinner, eh? Going out for dinner. Oh, my relay piece of Lexan, boys. I'm gonna screw all my relays to that under the hood and mount it and then make a cover and this and that and the other thing. So that's what that's for. Boys, boys. So in the video there, me and Frigma Sack, we ran the loom underneath the truck all nice and tidy and everything else. And I had to pull it all out yesterday, I did. Cause I had to run more lines to the back, eh? So I gotta get under, I just temporarily zip tied her up there. So I gotta get under there someday when I'm on a hoist and rerun that thing. Because I just, my fat ass just doesn't fit underneath that sport track. Not without jacking her up. I didn't feel like jacking her up yet. I am gonna give the torsion bars a little Oh, no way, and get the front end up a little higher because now that the front bumper's metal, it's brought the front end down a little bit. So we'll give her a little tweak on the old torsion bars there and bring her back up, eh? Why wouldn't I? Why the hell wouldn't I? That's all I got to my name today, boys. A loony, eh? 
Canadians and their loonies, boys. Okay, what's really going on? Holy, this ain't taking too long, boys. We're gonna have this done in a heartbeat, we are. Nothing like a video of me cleaning the shop, eh? Why wouldn't I, though? Gotta do her sometimes, we do. Got to do her sometimes, we do. We do. Why wouldn't we? Ooh, ooh, those are good parts, aren't they? Keep going. I just have enough for coffee. I ain't find enough change for coffee, I am. Brr, she's chilly out today, boys. I don't know whatever happened to Tommy, the cluster headache survivor, or whatever the hell his name is. He quit me, I guess, hey? Must have hurt his feelings somehow when I talked about London, hey? Didn't like that too much, I guess. Hey, Tommy? Didn't like that, bud? Oh, well. Suck it up, Buttercup. Why wouldn't you? Why the hell wouldn't you? Life's too short to worry about that kind of shit, boys and girls, eh? Life's too short. Here's some more cards for pugs to use for painting, eh? <laughs> some more painting cards, bud. You gotta call these guys and get a couple new batteries set too. Those batteries are done. Done, boys. This one looks like it's about ready to pop, it is, eh? Should put that somewhere safe in the house, maybe. What do you think? That's why it's sitting on the ground in the cement, just in case she decides to go. That way she'll just burn on the ground. Right, Scrappy? Hey, bud. I think I might just put them in there for now, boys. Just about done with the projects on the old sport track for a while there, so we'll have to get into something else. I'm hoping to get in the RC stuff again once I get my parts back from tracks, which I'm still waiting for. Okay? Man, oh man, they're taking forever, boys. I keep tracking them every day, and it's not their fault. It's Canadian faculty. Okay? The mail system in Canada is just slower than dicks. Actually, sometimes dicks are fast, so I don't know what else to say there. Depends what kind of mood you're in, I guess, eh? Just want to get her over with, it's fast. You don't want it, then it's slower than dicks. There you go. Oh, I gotta call my buddy too. I gotta call my buddy, I do, at the old welding door. Tim. I'm gonna call you, Tim. I just haven't had a chance to, bud. Come over and get that metal table. Friggin' right, I will. Tim's got me a metal table, he does. Hey? Eh? Oh, Tim. I wouldn't he? I send him enough work through work, I do. Hey? Eh? Them boys seem to be at my work once a month, they do. The old welding doors, eh? Welding doors, boys. Well, boys, I'm almost there, I am. I can see my bench again. Which is really my main concern. Here we go. I gotta get some metal for this, or you know what I should do is put that fucking fire blanket on it. The old board and everything else is all dirty as hell. Should give that a little job. Good right, dude. Tim's flying around. He is. All right. Hopefully on Saturday, or Saturday, today's Saturday, hopefully on Sunday, I get some me time, eh? So hopefully today, because you'll be watching this on Sunday, hopefully today, I'll be doing something. I don't know what yet, but I'll be doing her. Right now, she's watching me in the window, she is. Oh, boys. I just blew a whole bunch of dirt in my coffee. Why wouldn't I? I'm almost done, then we'll go for a drive. She wants to go for a drive, she does. We're gonna go in and see Grandma and take up her kitty litter for her because she lives on the third floor and Mom's getting a little old, eh? Sorry, Mom, I'm getting a little old, you are. Help you out with the old kitty litter. It is a bit taking up three floors, though. She gets these two big boxes of cat poop stuff. And then you gotta go up three flights of stairs with the damn things. And I think she already called me, so I gotta check my phone because I heard it ringing earlier and I just didn't have time to look and I want a new coffee because I got shit in it and this and that and the other thing. Right, Scrappy? Just that and the other thing, Scrappy. Hey, eh? What do you think? Do you want to go for a car ride? Do you want to go for a car ride today? Look at you. Half a tooth. Eh? Old half a tooth there, Scrappy. Bless ya. Bless ya. Yeah. Are you going to choke for me? <coughs> Do you want to go for a car ride? Do you want to go for a car ride? Where's Grandpa? Is Grandpa here? Want to go get him? Anyways, boys, I'll take you outside there and show you close encounters of the third kind, eh? Freaking right I will. And I've dragged them things again. I put these little flaps down here to stop the flaps from doing the old blowing in the wind straight up thing and uh i'm hitting them on stuff boys but anyways yeah look at this boys i got them lights working i do i went a little crazy with light bars hey as you can see up there little light barge happening just a little one hey eh? just a little one got the old front light barge working gonna have two more nine inches here facing out sideways so i can see what's coming freaking right i am the back lights boys they work pretty good they do i ran over my thing here and broke that so i gotta get a new one of them and uh what else i gotta tell you Nothing, hey? Not a damn thing. But there's the back ones, boys. Check out them lights, hey? They work decent. It's daytime, but you know, they're freaking nice and bright, they are. And the front ones are just absolutely ridiculous, boys. Just blind you to death, eh? Why wouldn't I? Check out that, boys, hey? What's really going on? Oh, Lee. It hurts in the daytime, for Christ's sakes. Freaking right, it does. 
Why wouldn't it? Oh, and just so you know, boys, that top light bar there, this one here, this is an aux beam it is, hey? And this one come from Willpower, it did, hey? That one's from Willpower. Cheap light, 70, $79 for that light bar. It's not as bright as this one, obviously, because look at the LED differences, eh? I got to send this to Oxbeam, though, and they want to know what series it was, and I wasn't sure because I have three LEDs burn out in it. I'll have to send that video off to Oxbeam, or if Oxbeam's watching, if you see this Oxbeam, that's the light right there, eh? That one's the one that's got three LEDs out of her. She's only about two weeks old, boys, eh? Hey? Two weeks old. But this quality of this, this willpower is, like I said, a cheap light. It's not the quality of the ox beam. But uh, thanks, boys, for the old willpower, eh? Willpower, and I got the two nine inch willpowers coming, I do. But these are little ox beamers here, they are, and they work good, they do. Friggin' right. So I just wanted to tell you that, and I'll put the links in the description below. And... But, anyways, I went out Baja on last night down some dirt roads, I did. Look at the friggin' mud flats. They're working, boys, eh? Hey? They're working. They're catching the mud, they are. Friggin' right, they are. Barry's almost dead, gonna plug you back in. But anyways, yeah, a little close encounters there. The third kind's come along pretty good, eh? I'll be able to talk to the alien soon, I will. Friggin' right, I will. Hey, friggin' right. I don't know if I like the light bar on top, though. It looks kinda, it looks like really, really, really kinda goofy it does, but I don't care. <laughs> hey, who gives a crap, boys? Look at that thing. Look at it. What's really going on? I'm official. I officially live in, this, in the country I do, eh? That's what happens when you live in the country for a little bit. You start to become a redneck, you do. Friggin' right, you do. That's decent. And actually, if it wasn't for you guys, I'd probably never do this, eh? This is all for my YouTube fans, it is. Just tinkering with everything I am. Just make everything custom, eh? Custom Bilsom. Why wouldn't I? Pugs got me hooked, he did. I have to blame him for that. He, def he definitely got me hooked on the customizing of metal, say it does. I like welding with metal, I've always have, but I've never done anything like that before, eh? I normally just do stuff around the house. So that's pretty decent, boys. I don't care if it looks redneckish. I think it's hilarious. But anyways, hopefully everybody has a good day and maybe goes to a Santa Claus parade or two today. Why wouldn't you? And uh, you know what to do for now. <laughs>